during this period, they must exercise patience and self-control in order to overcome all obstacles. They have now passed the first test, and the next step they must take is to enter the noble life of a true monk. In entering the monkhood, they will embark upon a life that promises great learning, which will allow them to experience a novel kind of happiness. The orange robe is as well unique. It's something that uh, you have to experience to um, feel what comes with, with these three pieces of cloth that, that we have. And um, I clearly remember the day of the ordination when uh, uh, we went out from the chapel and uh, we were getting dressed in this uh, orange robe. And, um, there was no holy light or some kind of special wind coming. It was a very simple moment, but I remember walking the first steps and, and feeling something and feeling a new presence. And um, every step that I was, was making going, going back to the chapel was, was very meaningful because I had more more presence and you feel that this, this robe comes with thousand years of respect as well. So um, you, you have to, to feel when you dress this, this robe and uh, it's again a very special experience. At first, the IDOP life was slightly difficult. Everything was very new, everything was very strange to me. But once I got used to it, it it's a very simple life. It's a very satisfying life. It's a life where you can relax in everything you do and at the same time focus on every single task you're given. So it's, it's a very unique kind of life. Well, you see, in outside world, there's happy and there's sad all the time. But once you're ordained in Buddhism, it kind of stabilizes and then there'll be like normal and then happy, normal and then happy because it simplifies your life. You see, the more you have, when you lose, you get sad. But in Buddhism, you have so little and you don't really lose anything. And it just, it's just perfect. You know, it's more than a religion, it's more like a way of life.
As a monk, he must endeavor to train himself. He must learn to endure hunger. He must work to maintain the purity of his 227 precepts and exercise religious austerity so that he can be the field of merit for the laity. Go 然后也可以修了很多工德我来到这边呢就是可以找到内在的那个平静 uh, they, they were preparing uh, many things very carefully, very delicately and throughout this uh, process I know that I knew that they, ha they are really happy they uh, have good meditation experience because we do, you don't need to tell about uh, good meditation experience because it, uh, show, it, it is shown by uh, behavior so I also uh, try to uh, be uh, have a good mind, everything, think everything positively, uh, and finally, it was good for me, not for every, not for others, but for me first and others either. If you are unhappy, if you come here, if you are an happy person, you can be happy, and if you are happy already, you can find another happiness. It is hoped that this school of life will impress upon these international students the concept of a novel lifestyle, which is the monastic life. Later, it is up to them to apply what they have learnt to their daily life. At least once in your life, give yourself the chance to enter the monkhood and experience inner happiness.